Hi everyone, it's Mrs. Davini, and I wanted to go over uh, what you need to do when you are doing any discussion in the fine art course. Uh, for those of you who might need a little refresher, and I'm going to um, share the unit one discussion and know that um, everything that applies with the unit one discussion will apply to every discussion that you might be doing uh, this year in fine art. So for unit one, you want to go to understanding art and scroll down where it says unit discuss getting to know you and um, scroll to the assessment and click on that. Now, um, it's always a good idea to look at the grading rubric, okay, um, so that you know what you need to do in order to get the maximum number of points. And in pretty much every case, responding to the topic on time, answering the initial discussion questions, responding to two of your classmates posting and um, including high quality content is our good ways to um, get the maximum points and also added significantly to the discussion uh, by suggesting solutions or pointing out problems or um, asking questions is also a good way to get the maximum number of points. So it's a good idea to check that out. So uh, I like to go to the little drop down menu here on the right hand side, the little arrow and click to view topic in reading view. That's my personal preference. It's totally up to you how you do it. But right here, um, if you're in the reading view, you have the, que the initial questions that you need to answer before you start your thread. So in this case, it's introducing yourself. Uh, telling you what interests you about art or other hobbies, who your favorite artist is and why. And so after you answer those three questions, you need to post your responses. So you would go to start a new thread and enter a title or a subject and uh, whatever you can title it, uh, whatever you want. Um, my interests or anything that, um, you feel like is appropriate, you would um, start to type the answers to the questions here in the box. And if you wanted to add, uh, in this case, a selfie or um, a picture of your favorite artist or something the artist has created, then you want to insert the image, go to the little camera. Now, I prefer that you use an image that you have stored on your computer and not a URL. Using the URL is just very time consuming for me. So um, if you want to share something, you should have the uh, photo or picture of it already on your computer. You click computer, uh, upload the file and go to where you have it saved and then add it. Uh, and that's uh, as simple as that to add that in there. So once you um, have answered the three questions, uh, then you post it. And once you post it, uh, you're still not done. You need to go and read two classmates posts. So you would scroll down to all of these um, posting by other classmates, uh, click on the one, read it and um, try to um, ask a question, uh, post a comment, uh, and then uh, you're done. So don't forget, you need to answer the initial questions and then read two other classmates' uh, responses and comment on their responses. That applies to all the, um, all the um, other discussions you will do in this course.